Hey there, it's Pamela here at Parsons. I'm up in the Christmas shop and I want to give you some tips and tricks on how to decorate your Christmas tree. So let's start off with your ornaments. A good thing to go by is, say if you're buying new ornaments or you're adding to your collection, I would go with about nine, say like this. You want it to be symmetrical. You want it to be universal over your tree, not just one here, something completely different over there. It kind of gives a better theme and a better look. And I want to show you a little idea on how to hang your ornament. So you see how we have this ornament like this. You just put the ornament on here. Now, here's a cute little trick. You can take it like this, bend that up, and there you go. And once you have it like that all over your tree, it's not just hanging. It's just all about your preference and what your look is. Now, if that's not your thing, just put it back like this. And when you're, or if it is your thing and you're ready to take it off, it's easy peasy, okay? Now, let's talk about ribbon. First of all, if you shop here at Parsons, which I hope you do, our ribbon sells out super quick. It's high quality, it's amazing. So, say if you were putting ribbon all over your tree and you needed, it's about 10 yards on a roll. I would probably definitely get two rolls, but to be on the safe side, get three rolls because we know how it is. You get home, you're decorating, and then you're like, oh my gosh, I have this much more to do and I have not the same ribbon. Well, then you come in here and guess what? That ribbon is sold out. So, do yourself a favor. Get at least more than you need, one or two rolls, and if you have that much left over, you can, you know, make more poofs, you could make something for like a lamp or etc. Now, these are really easy. This is just poofs that we have tripled ribbon up, and Chris, the owner, did a poof video. If you go back into our videos, you'll find it, and she kind of shows you how that's done. It's so easy. It's like a bow, but not, because it's a poof. So anyway, you put little poofs all over your tree. Look how cute that looks. Now, let's talk about these big ornaments. If big ornaments is your thing, you need to do them in like five or sixes because once again, it gives that symmetrical look. If you see, we have one here. We have a big one here, a big one here, over here. They're just all throughout the tree and it really kind of sets the tone and gives it a different look than just having little tiny ornaments all over your tree, okay? Now, you're thinking, what do y'all always do for your tree toppers at Parsons? We mostly do picks, okay? And I'm gonna tell you why. They're easy, they're fun, there's no right or wrong way to do it. You just get up there, you start putting them in. Once you get them up there, let me show you these. You fluff them, put them in the tree. You can fluff them before or after. And like I said, there's no right or wrong way. You can bend them. This guy here, just needs to be fluffed. Look at that. Look how ex the expansion on picks is so fun and neat to do. And again, there's no wrong way to do this, okay? It's whatever. So you would have maybe, you know, three or four of each of these picks. You could put the big one in the middle. If you wanted big ones to be on the side and really drape over, you can see how exaggerated that gets. Really pretty. Um, People have taken some of these picks off this tree. That's why it, there's not as many as there was. Because now at Parsons, we are allowing customers to shop our trees, which means come up to your favorite tree. If you're like, oh, I like this poof. Oh, I like this, you know, this ornament. You can just take it right off the tree. No problem. But when you're buying picks, keep in mind, same thing as your ribbon. More is better. I promise you. You do not want to get home. You're having company come over, you're adding to your tree, you're finishing to your tree, and you're like, I needed like three more of those picks. Just buy the picks, okay? And if you need to return them, you can. It's our normal return policy as usual on stuff like that. Keep that in mind. Um, but the main thing is, this stuff gets sold out. If we all that work here at Parsons had a dollar for every time someone says, I was in yesterday at five o'clock and I saw this cute little snowman lamp and it's the next day at 11. And they're like, where's that cute snowman lamp? It's not here because it's sold. So even me as an employee, I may come in, see something I love, and I think, oh, I'll get that the next time I work. And it's gone. It's happened so many times. So if you see something, just get it. Just get it. I'm telling you, you'll be thankful you did. So that's our little tips and tricks on how to decorate a Christmas tree. Again, I'm Pamela here at Parsons. If you want to come find me in the Christmas shop, just come up here and say hello. Thank you. Take care. Right here at Parsons where fun meets fabulous every day.